Welcome to Hangover Reviews. Today's review is on Green Room. Green Room is a 2015 thriller movie written and directed by Jeremy Solnier. It's about a punk band that gets caught up in some neo-Nazi shit. Green Room is a great movie. It has a really gripping story and builds up tension well throughout. Not just in the way that it's written, but also in the way that it's shot and the way that it uses sound. It uses very few locations and creates a claustrophobic vibe along with that Hitchcockian suspense. There are also great performances from the whole cast. Anton Yelchin, Alia Shawkat and Imogen Poots all portray very relatable characters as the victims. Patrick Stewart is very believable and scary as the head neo-Nazi. It's hard to get more into this film without spoiling anything, so I'm just gonna recommend you watch it and leave it at that. Thrillers don't usually make good hangover viewing. This one's no different. In fact, it's worse than most. For starters, it's about a punk band, so there's a lot of punk music, which isn't quite easy listening unless you're a hardcore fan of the genre. And the movie is tense and scary as shit. These aren't great qualities in a hangover movie. And then there's the gore. You do see some real fucked up shit in this movie. Shit you just don't want to see with a hangover. Other than the music, it's fairly tame for the first 40 minutes. So I guess you could just watch that part and then save the rest for later. I don't know why you would do that, but you could. I would recommend you just avoid it altogether. It's a great movie, but it's horrible for a hangover. That's the review for this week. If you liked it, subscribe for a new video every Sunday. And if you have a suggestion for a review, you can leave it in the comments, tweet me at Hangover Reviews, post it on Hangover Reviews Facebook page, or email me at hangoverreviews at gmail.com. Have a good hangover. I'll see you next Sunday.